Years ago, I heard a song, I want to be a clone. Hey, it's a trigger, Rich Von Trigger. How you doing today? You know, in reality, we all are posers at some level. But in the speaking world, this is a very common phenomenon and something I have to coach people through to get past the posing stage. We want to be the next Tony Robbins. We want to be the next John Maxwell or whoever it is that you admire and really like. Now, hang on for a second, because I coach people to go study and like and follow great speakers. We should want to learn from the best of the best to keep enhancing our skills. But the strange thing is we try to actually become Tony Robbins. We actually try to become John Maxwell or whoever it is that you admire and like. In the speaking world, we actually try to dress like them. We actually take on their mannerisms. We, we, we start doing things and posting things just like they do. You don't have to be a clone. Imposter system is a real thing in the speaking community. And rather than being an imposter, rather than being a clone, let's embrace our uniqueness. Let's embrace who we really, really are and answer a couple questions to help you find that uniqueness. Number one, what are you most passionate about? I'm a passion-driven person. Way back in the day, I was trying to be too cool. My cousin was very slick. He was an athlete. He was a musician. I tried to play the drums. I tried to play the guitar. I tried to be really cool. I tried to dribble a basketball, and I was horrible at all of it. <laughs> I finally found out that I am passionate about people and service and things like that, and I did not have to be my cousin. I could be me, and the more I became me, the greater person I became. What are you passionate about? I am passionate about serving people. I'm a coach by nature. What are you by nature? What just naturally oozes out of you? I'm a coach. I can't help it, whether I'm in the sports world as a broadcaster, behind the microphone, or whether I'm out speaking and leading. I am a coach because I'm a dreamer. I'm a dreamer that loves to hear your crazy dreams. I want to get around you, help you, and you can reach the sky, and I'm going to help you do that, whatever your dream is. I want to coach you up to the next level. Oh, I love being around dreamers and people that are entrepreneurs. What are the things that make you so unique like that? And embrace those. Learn to pull off the mask. Stop trying to be somebody else and just be yourself. And here's the great thing about this. The more you embrace you being you and the real authentic you, the more people will embrace you. The more they'll want to listen, the more they'll want to follow, the more they'll want to hear. And it's a lot more relaxing and easy, by the way. Being a poser takes a lot of energy. You always have to have that right look, the right style, the, the right clothing. You have to have just the perfect word that comes out. And as somebody that stutters, I've had to embrace that fact and let people know that I stutter. So when I blow it on stage, part of my uniqueness is I laugh, I joke, I break the ice, and I go right on. And people sit back and go, you know what? He's okay. Let's not be posers. Let's not be clones. Let's just be who we are wired to be and take it to the next level because people need your uniqueness. They don't need another Tony Roberts. They don't need another John Maxwell or whoever it is that you like. What they need is you and what you have to offer. Let me hear from you today. What are you most passionate about? What just naturally oozes out of you and you can't help it, and that's who you are. What are your unique experiences? Experiences make who you are in so many ways as speakers, as leaders. We need to bring that to the forefront and share our experiences that make us unique so people can shine and grow and become who they are in whatever industry and whatever career they are in. I'd love to hear from you today. Let's all agree, no more clones. And let's embrace the true you of who you are. Hey, until next time, it's a trigger, Rich Bond trigger. Have a great day and keep rocking the stage.